And out of some education news, more school districts are returning to in-person learning across the state, which means bus drivers are back at work despite the risk of COVID-19 exposure. Our morning reporter Pepper Baker spoke to a 75-year-old bus driver in Peach County about driving during the pandemic. 75-year-old Charles Rump enjoys being a bus driver because he likes to interact with the students. I like for them to be in school because they give me a chance to not to be home. And, and I like being around them and, and they give me the experience to learn more about them. He's been driving for Peach County Schools since 2007, but his routine changed when schools closed in spring because of COVID-19. I miss driving and, and uh, when school shut down, then I had to try to find something else to do to keep stay busy. So you know, I was kind of glad when they did open up. The Centers for Disease Control says eight out of 10 COVID-19 deaths reported in the United States are adults over the age of 65, but that didn't stop Rump from going back to work. I thought about it, but then long as I put, uh, kept myself protected and, and with my kids, I make sure that they are protected. The district trained drivers on their safety guidelines and Rump says he follows them every time students ride the bus. Guideline that were laid out to us was that to make sure that the, that the kids have the mask, we have our masks on, and at the end of each route, we would spray the bus down and wipe it down to make sure that we kill germs and before we go and go to our other route. And so it's been working out pretty good. In Peach County, Pepper Baker, 13 WMAZ News. Peach County bus drivers are working part-time for now. Rump, though, hopes to return full-time after Christmas break.